Hi, in this lesson, I'm going to demonstrate how to plot a simple network. Given the fact that you've got a list of eight activities and you have the predecessors for each activity identified. And so when we look at predecessors, what this means is that B can't start until A is completed. Same with C. In the case of E, both B and C need to be completed before E can start. So we're going to do activity on the node, and each activity is going to be represented by a box. And the first activity is the one without any predecessors, which is A. Draw a box there and put an A in it. As soon as A is done, B can start. And we draw an arrow to indicate that, as well as C. And as soon as B is done, D can start. E can start as soon as B and C is done. So we draw a box here. But this time we have two arrows going into E. F can start as soon as D is done. And finally, G can start as soon as both E and F are done. And that would be the network given this information. Uh, two things to remember. A is a burst activity, which means more than one activity can start as soon as it's done, indicated by that arrow. And then E and G are both merge activities. E can't start until more than one activity are completed. In this case, it's B and C. In the case of G, it's F and E. And that's how you draw a simple network.